you know what I'm thankful for? Happy accidents. The stupid, simple, happy accidents where absent-mindedness just leads to something good. Because it normally doesn't happen that way. Think about it. You get approximately, we'll say 70 years on this planet, and all it takes is one big screw-up, one mistake. One thing where you zigged where you should have zagged, and you're dead. The end. You don't get a second chance on it. Everybody faces that sort of stuff, and I'm not talking about stuff on that level either, if, if we're being for realsies. And I think we're being for realsies. Are we being for realsies, you guys? Yeah, that's right. We're being for realsies. Anywho, uh... It's hot. It's stupid hot. I know you guys have seen me sweat. I had a, a, a wonderful sweat-a-thon. But, uh, man, today today makes that day just look chilly. No, that's not true at all. But it's, it's probably about 93 degrees out right now. But with the relative humidity that we get in this area and in the southeast, it's, it's, ugh. It's at least 100 degrees in the heat index. It's supposed to peak out at, I think, like 104, 105 heat index around 6 o'clock this afternoon. That's hot, guys. It's really hot. And the humidity just makes everything just feel bleh. I'm shocked I'm not already sweating. That's normally what happens. You step outside, all the humidity, the heat smashes you in your face, and you just instantly feel as though you're covered in goo and just sweat and just moisture and condensation. I'm not complaining, though, because I'm the only person in the office that I worked in today who got to, and on the regular, gets to stay inside directly underneath an air conditioning unit. So I am thankful for that as well. So I'm thankful for my happy, stupid accident of leaving my windows down so that I wouldn't die of asphyxiation when I got into my car. And I am also thankful that I didn't have to be out in this junk today because whew, it's nasty. Like, just talking right now, I'm working up a sweat, and I'm not even kidding. It's hot. I hope it's cooler where you guys are. If not, you know, we'll all get through this together. It seems like this is always the way it happens. By the end of July, we're like, oh, cool. Summer's almost over. People are going to go home. School's going to be in session. But that's not true. Summer is not almost over. Summer season, sure, yeah. The, a lot of the tourists will go home within the next month or so. Kids go back to school within the next month or so. But August is going to be crazy hot. It always is. It's been rainy all July. It's going to be crazy hot in August. But, you know, that's, that's just the, the, the things that I chose when I decided this is where I was going to live my life. I decided that there were going to be some unbearably hot months, but you know what? The fall, the winter, the spring, and most of the summer here is freaking perfect. I love it. So I'm not leaving. Not yet. Maybe someday. Who knows? But anyways, that's enough. I'm about to head home and do some home stuff, so I'll catch you guys later.